my beloved love. So I sense that you, divine feminine, are sending this masculine into an ego death. That's what I see with this death card reversed. But this is bringing up a lot of fear within him because this can really represent someone who's having difficulty moving forward, afraid of some kind of a new beginning, repeating their own negative patterns. So what I'm getting is really, it's almost like this masculine misses you and is trying to actively come towards you to deepen your bond, to communicate with you. But it's like your spirit guides are blocking him from fully connecting with you. It's as though they're saying to him, if you want to approach Divine Feminine, you have to approach her energy with the utmost respect and reverence, and with a deep acknowledgement of how profound this spiritual bond is between the two of you. It's almost like you are that holy sacred space that this masculine is trying to enter, but he isn't carrying the reverence for your sacred energy as he tries to approach you, or as he tries to enter your space, or enter your life. Now in some cases, I am getting that there could be a really strong physical attraction from this masculine towards you. And because he is not fully awakened yet spiritually, he might mistakenly believe that this is purely a physical attraction purely at the superficial level. Now of course, Divine Feminine, you are very beautiful. You carry this really beautiful energy. And I'm also picking up that there is something about your physical appearance that is very striking as well. And this actually stems from the energy that you carry, the light that you carry. However, you might come across people who feel this attraction to you physically, but they assume it's on the surface. They assume that it's purely physical. They don't realize that the true pull of your energy is actually deeply spiritual and deeply energy. It's a kind of light. It's a kind of vibration that you carry. And again, I feel as though this masculine is being actively blocked from fully approaching you or fully entering your life until he develops a greater reverence for the sacredness of this bond and for the rarity of your energy. Because what I'm also picking up is that this masculine energy might still be telling himself that he would be able to dismiss his feelings for you at will. That again, this is very surface level. He's consciously convincing himself that this really isn't necessarily a rare bond, even though everything within him at a deeper intuitive level is trying to tell him that there is something really special here. And I'm hearing you need to be cautious, not you, divine feminine, but this masculine, it's like his guides are trying to tell him that he needs to be cautious with how he approaches you because he could, in some sense, taint a really beautiful, sacred soul connection or get himself blocked out of your life if he doesn't approach you correctly. With the balance card in the reverse position, I'm getting that this masculine is very taken aback by your connection. From Divine Muscular, type yes if you believe.